we shift back to Victoria Place City Hall, where we revisit Lucy in the lobby. She's been checking in guests upon arrival. Lucy! Oh, you startled me. That's Johnny Fiore, host of the Silent Art Auction. I need you to go downstairs and get me a light bulb. Uh, from the basement? Yeah, the basement. One of the ceiling bulbs is out in the main room, which reminds me you're going to need a ladder, too. Uh, but I'm checking in guests, Mr. Fiore. I've noticed there's more on the list compared to last year. Now! I'll ask Blake to help, if that's all right. Oh, he's so nice. I have him checking cards. Kelsey's on drinks. That leaves a you. How about I ask one of the bouncers to come with me? I can't carry a ladder, sir, up a flight of stairs. It'll put some muscle on you. A butch woman in an evening gown walks up with her daughter and grandchild. Good evening. Do you have an invitation? It's me, Lucy. Marcy McDonald. Mrs. McDonald? Oh, I didn't recognize you. You're wearing a... A dress. A beautiful dress. I've never seen... What, you, you think lesbians don't ever wear dresses? We only wear boy clothes? Mama. Of course not. I think you look lovely. And I think you're covering up too much titty with that shawl. Mama, leave her be. Can we have our tickets, please? I'm just trying to figure out what she meant by them words, Sheila. That's all. It's, it's, it's like she wants me to wear, start wearing dresses or something. Lucy's just being a good crush gem. What's this got to do with church? How's them classes going, Lucy? We're still on break for another two weeks. I miss our study group. Well, when I get some more money, I plan to come back. Mama has some crazy get-rich-quick scheme. We'll see. You know, Lucy, you should come dance for me. I certainly will not. Hey, might be good for you to dance and show off them ditties. I know some old men who pay good money. Mama! For <laughs> Is it your son's birthday today? No. Some guy gave the balloons to us on the way in. Tell her who gave them to you. Lucy's been through enough of your jammerin', Mama. It was the, no. the fortune teller. The f f f f f he's here? You ain't coming in, Lucy. Mama, now you best stop torturing this poor girl. She ain't done nothing to you but say you look party. I apologize. Here, let's give her a balloon to cheer up. That's your baby, all right. Just like you was, crying any time I took something away from you. Of course it's my baby. Whose else would it be? You should tie the balloons together so he won't lose any. Oh, um, he'll hold him tight all night. He's got the grip to crack a walnut. You ought to know. He bruised your titties many a time while sucking on him. Mama! You've done now said titty 18 times. Let's go. Lucy looks out towards the front door. She sees a faint red glowing in the window. Oh! Lucy clutches her shawl. Oh.